Hey guys, it's Ty here. I'm one of the founders of Redeemly. Today, I want to help you increase your revenue, average your order value, your lifetime value using Redeemly. What is Redeemly? Good question. Basically, think cashback loyalty system powered by true store credit, all right? We're using the real Shopify store credit native system. Unlike most other loyalty systems out there, this is the way that loyalty should be. This is a new system. No one's really using it yet, and it works like magic. I want to get you set up just like all the other stores that are earning some great money, already getting customers coming back and buying for life, all right? Um, now, uh, first things first, what we need to do is set up a few things to get this working on your store. We've got a few things to do. So one, we need to... Uh, activate the store-wide program. Uh, number two, we need to show some widgets on your store to make sure that people can see your program. And number three, we need to make sure that the customers know about their credit that's gonna be uh, applied to their accounts using our notification system or Clavio integrations, the way that it just set it up the way that you want, okay? Um, now, uh, first things first though, is we actually need to upgrade uh, our store over to the new customer accounts, V2, if you haven't done that already. The way you're gonna know if you haven't done that is if you see this banner at the top here. What you need to do is click this button here and you need to go and enable uh, version two of customer accounts. If you don't see this banner, basically you're already set up. You can skip this little step. I'm gonna click it and just show you how to do it. It's really simple. What we need to do first is we need to uh, toggle this on right here, and then we need to switch over to customer accounts, okay? Now, uh, you can have a quick read here and click on the learn more button to learn a little bit more about maybe some of the limitations that are gonna happen when you switch over to this, but it also opens up a whole plethora of extra things and new things that uh, Shopify is gonna integrate into this new account system, okay? Uh, and one of those is store credit. So we're gonna update right now, click on the store credit toggle right here, and once we're happy with everything, we need to go back to our app and see if that little banner has disappeared. Let's have a look. There we go, it's gone. Next thing is store-wide programs. We need to set that up. Uh, you're gonna click on this button here. I'm just gonna click on the edit one because I've already got one set up. Uh, we've got two types of credit. We've got percentage of order and fixed goal amounts, all right? Um, now, percentage of order is basically a percentage back of a total uh, customer's order as credit. So 5% back or 10%. It's kind of like your generic cash back kind of offer, 10% cash back as credit, okay? Uh, simple as that. And then we've got the fixed goal amounts. This is the one I normally suggest people try first. Uh, fixed goal amounts are kind of better for increasing average order value. That's the reason why I like to do it, okay? So you can sit it at really uh, specific points. Uh, so you can think about your current average order value, and then you can maybe select a goal that's a little bit higher than that and entice customers to add more to their cart to try and unlock the credit, all right? Um, so we can actually have certain tiers here. So like spend goal one, spend goal two, spend goal three. Spend goal one, I do advise that you try and make it really easy for a customer to unlock because you actually wanna use the credit to bring them back again. Don't forget that. You don't wanna just uh, keep the credit just for the high spenders. You still wanna use it as an enticer for that lifetime value um, number to increase, okay? Uh, now, uh, yeah, so spend goal, spend goal, spend goal. We've got those set up. What I would like to do is draw your attention to the expires section down here. So what we can do is have an expiry on the credit that we've issued uh, so that the customer is enticed to actually spend the credit before it runs out. This works extremely well. This is actually one of the biggest reasons uh, and draw cards for a customer to come back to your store and spend their credit, all right? Uh, so definitely have a play with this. I recommend either 30 to 60 days, depending on your customer lifetime value. It's gonna be different for every store. But once we're happy with everything here, all we need to do is click on save, okay? Uh, and if we wanna activate that, we actually need to click here and we need to activate but before we activate we can actually go and start looking at how it's going to look on the website so what i'll do is i'm going to discard this and i'm just going to keep it disabled i'm happy with everything here but now i'm going to go over to the on-site content section and you can go through each one of these i'll explain them quickly but i'm not going to show you how to set them all up they're pretty easy to answer so we've got the launcher here we've got uh, redeemly on product pages redeemly on the cart page and then we've got redeemly after purchase all right uh, pretty simple to get your head around i will draw your attention to the launcher um, so this is this little launcher guy that sits in the bottom corner corner of your store that basically uh, communicates your offers to the customer, okay? Uh, I definitely recommend setting this up. Uh, it's pretty simple to do. Just click on add in theme editor after you've customized it the way that you want it to look. Uh, the next thing you want to do is uh, definitely add Redeemly on product pages. It's pretty simple. It sits above the add to cart. Uh, you can click here and watch the tutorial. Redeemly on cart page. Basically, you can add this to your cart page as well uh, and make sure that you're communicating how much a customer is going to get back for spending, uh, which is going to increase your conversion rates as well. Uh, and then you can also here uh, activate the Monster Cart integration, which is our other app that helps increase the average order value of a customer. Uh, communicate your store credits within that cart app by clicking enable here. And the next thing I'm going to do is show you this. So after purchase on thank you pages, you can also watch this tutorial here on how to set that up. But you basically uh, can add this to your thank you pages as well, teaching customers and telling them about the credit that they just unlocked with their purchase. Now, once you've got your on-site content done, what you want to do is come down to the notification section, then you need to activate this. Um, so what this is, is 
We've actually got our inbuilt email notifications uh, where you can click on each one of these and it's got a generic um, email that's going to go out on behalf of you. You can change all the subject headlines. I like to make sure that we've got the amount of store credit that a customer has got uh, up in the subject headline to increase the click-through rates. Once we're happy, make sure you've clicked on enabled and come back and do that for each one of these uh, email notifications here. And if you don't want to use our email system, that's okay too. You can use our integration with Clevio. So you click integrations, click on manage, click on the help desk here, and you can learn how to actually set that up as well. All right. Uh, but I definitely recommend sending emails. This will increase customers' comeback and increasing that lifetime value for you. Now, now, uh, once we are happy with our notifications, we've got the on-site content ready to go. All we need to do is come back over to our home section here. We need to click on edit and we need to activate our offer and click save. Voila, boom, it is alive. It is increasing your lifetime value and your average order value right now. <laughs> happy days. If you need any help, don't worry. Just reach out to the team. Click on this little button down here. We'll be happy to help. Go increase your revenue. This is loyalty and a subscription app. This is a loyalty app built with store credit the way that loyalty always should be.